We're back with another episode of Jimmy Tells Tales, where Jimmy tells us all his favorite stories. Tell us another story, Jimmy. This is a good story. It goes back to when I was just in kindergarten. The teacher had all of us students outline our hand on a piece of paper, and then she gave all those sheets of paper to a band called Magical Mighty Mike. Magical Mighty Mike was the manager of the magnificent Mouse Milk Company, and he worked for the Queen of England. Yes, and what he did, he picked the smallest hand in the group, which was my hand, and he made me a mouse milker. Now let me tell you how he did it. He took me down the street, and on the side of a building, which nobody noticed, way down along the sidewalk, was a little tiny door. It was the door front for the his magnificent, mighty, magical milk company. And behind the door were 30 mice, 30 little mice. Now, how I got into that door was he showed me how, he showed me how to make my face look like a mouse. <laughs> so he did. So when I knocked on the door, he, 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 and they looked out, they saw a mouse. It looked just like them, so he let me in. That's how I got in. Once inside, the first time I was totally amazed. There were 30 little mice running around, all waiting to be milked. See, they got milked once a day. Yes. And he gave me a little tiny stool. Now, thank goodness, when he made my face look like a mouse, I became small because when I was big, I could have sat on the little tiny stool. It would have been very uncomfortable. So, I'd sit on my stool and I'd milk my 30 mice. Then I'd put them in a little container and I'd homogenize it, just like the milk you drink at home. Very healthy. And I'd put it in a little bottle, and then it would go to England for the Queen of England for her special house milk parties. She had special friends there. They had little demi tasse cups, little tiny sauces or whatever, and little tiny penny fours. Penny fours are little tiny statuary for the Queen of England. It was amazing, this job. And it went on for the whole year when I was a kindergarten. Pretty soon though, I got a little too big. So even though my mouse face was on, they realized, ah, we can't let him in here. And I lost my job. But I want to tell you this, towards the end though, I got to deliver the milk. That was the best part. I went to England, I met the Queen of England with my little chosen mouse milk. How's that? 